Hello everyone, today I am doing an Outcrate unboxing. So if you don't know, Outcrate is a monthly YA book box that is themed each month that comes with a newly released YA book and three to five coincident items that go along with that theme. If you're interested in Outcrate, you can use my code bookables for 10% off. I don't get any money or commission off of that code. Instead, I get a free box to review for all of you guys every month. So just so you know, the 10% is to save you some money, which I always highly recommend you do. So as always, I will leave all the links down below and let's get into opening this box. Also, as always, I don't know what the theme is. So this is the card we have this month, and this month's theme is an enchanted forest, and as we can see, we have a wolf and like a princess type of character trudging through the snow in the forest, which is great. The first thing I see, I think, is a blanket, which is amazing, because you know what you can never have enough of are blankets. Like, I love blankets. I think we all could probably just have a closet <laughs> So this one is an all forest or magic throw blanket. Ooh, exciting. I'm excited to open this up. This is what it looks like. I have no clue. Oh, it's upside down. So I'll tell you what the quote says. It says, all forest or magic from Holly Black. I'm mean, gonna I guess this is from the Cruel Print series. Um, either way, it's beautiful. This doesn't do it justice. I'm gonna have to do like a close up to show you, but it's a pretty small blanket. Like I would just say it's kind of like a, like a throw blanket, if you will, which I think is fine too. So it's really cool. I like it a lot. So I'm definitely gonna use it because as always, you can never have enough blankets in your house. Next thing I think I see is a bookmark. Ooh, this is like a metal bookmark. How cool is that? And it says, a song in this forest, but it was a savage song, Whispering of Madness and Tearing Rage by Naomi Novik. Um, this might be from Spinning Silver or from might be um, Uprooted, which <laughs> I haven't read Uprooted, but I tried reading Spinning Silver and I got like halfway through and I had to DNF it, not because I really wasn't enjoying it. Uh, it's hard to say. I really was enjoying it, but it was such a slow paced book that it took me three days to read 50 pages because that's how slow of a pace it was. But it was beautifully written and I want to go back to it and I might, but it was just so insanely slow. And on the back, it's from, oh, it's from the creator, Her Paper World, and you have a little tassel, which I always love in bookmarks, so this is awesome. It is from the book Uprooted, which I haven't read. Either way, this is beautiful. I've never had a metal bookmark before. I've had wood ones, not a metal one. This is stunning. The next thing I see is a print and it says, once upon a time, I dared to dream of a strange, lovely world where I belonged. And this is from um, Amber in the Dust series, which again, I haven't read. Sorry, I keep going on frame. I'm not used to this background. Um, then we have the pin for this month, and it looks like it's like a moth and a moon. I, I don't know. It's beautiful. All the Romano pins are amazing. We have this thing right here, Alcrate Exclusive. It's created by Juden Pernay Designs, and I'm pretty sure... It's an ornament because every year they put a wooden ornament in it and every year I add it to my tree. Trees in your eyes, stars in your heart. I don't know what this is from, but it's got birds on it and it's beautiful. So this is from the Raven Boys. I should have known. I had a feeling when I saw the Raven, I was like pretty sure it was Raven Boys, but I don't know. But again, I will add this to my tree. I think, I think this might be my fourth or fifth ornament of Alcrate on my tree. So my plan eventually one year, hopefully next year, is to get my own Christmas tree for my office and just make it all bookish ornaments. And include and of course they will include Alcrate. I love their I love their wooden ones. I love how they have a theme. I love themes. And the next thing are some stickers. You know what I love? Stickers. This is Pip Stickers by Pip Sticks. So it's got like uh, a tree, a mushroom, owl, just really cute stuff. And then on the back, Alcrate even has their own stickers where it has Alcrate on it, Book Nerd. It's just great for your planner, which I just did a video where I planned my 2020 planner, like I put all my stickers in it. And now I'm gonna have to go back and put these on there. But either way, these are gorgeous. I'll never be mad about a sticker ever because I just love them so freaking much. The last thing we have this month is a planner. This is the reading planner. This is from Magical Monthly, I believe. This is an Alcrate exclusive. So this is a planner for your whole 2020 year um, and it's got notes in every month. What I like about it, it's got your book wish list and monthly TBR, um, weekly, and then it goes into a weekly planner. And then you even have a section for book reviews, which is awesome and it has little stars on it. And then, um, wow, it even has favorite quotes, monthly wrap up, where you can put your total books read, genres read. This is really great and I should probably use this for my own planner, but I've already started my planner, so I don't know. I might use this or I might give it away because it's a beautiful planner and I don't think I'll use it because I'm so invested in my planner that I have. It's like my fourth year using it and I'm already, you know, I'm the type of person that's like, stick with what you know, stick with what you like. This is really nice though. I do really enjoy it. So I don't know. I might see if I have a friend that wants it or I'm gonna do a giveaway for it because 
why not? I want it to be used. And I honestly don't think I'll use it, sadly, even though it's really designed for something that I would love to use. So I'm so conflicted, but it's freaking beautiful. And then the book this month is Winterwood by Shay Earnshaw. So if you guys don't know, I really love Shay Earnshaw books. She wrote The Wicked Deep last year, and it's one of my favorite books of all time. I have already read this book. Um, it has blue splayed edges. It's freaking phenomenal. And I believe the original cover is black. Yeah, it's black. I like this one, how it's winter, because winter is with snow and it's white and it's pretty. I really, oh crap, hopefully it's in frame. Hopefully it's in focus. It's a hard time focusing, but it is stunning. And this is signed, oh my goodness. I want to see what the hardback looks like. I believe there's a moon on the hardback. <gasps> I believe I already have a finished copy of Winterwood, so I might do a giveaway for that. So maybe I'll do a bundle where I can give Winterwood away and the Magical Planner. So either way, this is stunning. So it's all about a character named Nora, and her family is witches. Like, her mom was a witch, her grandma was a witch. She comes from the Walker line, which are all witches. And basically, she lives by herself near this forest, and the winter gets brutal. And she goes in the forest, and she finds a boy that's been missing from the camp or something across the lake. I have a whole review of it, um, so if you want to hear more about it, I'll link it up here and down below. But I really enjoyed it, not quite as much as The Wicked Deep. But I still, her writing is just so atmospheric and lyrical and it just makes you really feel like this is the perfect combo to put this book with a blanket that's in the box too because throughout reading this book, it wasn't even cold outside, but I wanted to bundle up under like a blanket and had a fire because she wrote it so insanely cold. So uh, I really wanted to love this book. I liked it. It wasn't quite there. Again, see my review. But so before we get into reviewing all the items, I do have a little booklet that comes with it each month. Um, and it just talks about, oh yeah, there's the um, original cover right here and then the Alcrate one. They're both honestly beautiful. You can't go wrong with either one. But honestly, the blue splayed edges really makes me love the Alcrate one more. Um, we also have, if you like this book, you might like these other books, things like that. It's just a really cool booklet. So Overall, I gotta say, this has been my most favorite box in a while. I think they're, uh, I can't remember the last time like I loved every single item, and this one I truly love every single item. Like I'm gonna use every single item other than the planner because I might give that away, but if I didn't already have a planner that I love so much, I would for real use that planner. So I don't know what to put as my favorite. I mean, I maybe want to put the bookmark as my favorite because I've never had a metal bookmark, but the blanket is amazing. The stickers are amazing. The ornament is amazing. The Everything is amazing in this box. So five out of five for me, honestly. I don't say that much with Outcrate because there's always a couple items. I'm just like, it's okay. It's not really up my alley. All of these are designed perfectly up my alley. A blanket and a bookmark and a stickers. Like, yes, please. I'll take all of them. So I'll link all of their websites and Instagram and all that stuff down below as well as my coupon code. I highly recommend you check them out because they're a great book box and this month they knocked it out of the park. So hope you, if you enjoyed this box as much as me, please let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye. I'll be home.